have you been? Sorry. Well, you could have called me. It's gone five in the morning. I thought you'd just off for a few drinks after the gig. Um, we got chatting. Yeah, it's not changed at all since high school. Yeah, uh, guess you could say things got a bit out of hand. What, and then you drove home? OK, well, uh, not out of hand, I just... I lost track of time. I'm sorry, it, it, it won't happen again. Hmm, that's what they all say. You coming in, then? You spoil that dog. No one else seems to think so. Hey, Ryan reckons he can teach him to do an high five. What? <laughs> you can't even fetch a ball, Dad. Huh? <laughs> eh? Well, it's only because he don't want to. No, he's only interested in two things, bacon and... and standing outside sniffing at Shadrach's grave. <laughs> hey, it's not just Shadrach that's buried there. There's a fair few other pets. Yeah, that is a lot of bones. Well, I wonder if he knows he'll be buried there one day. Oh, hey, don't listen to him, lad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, he's back with us. Fancy coming with me and Monty, hey? Fresh air might do you some good. No, no, it's all right. I've, I've got things to do. Yeah, like try sleep for one. <laughs> Uh, he's he's uh, smart, you know, he, he always knows what's coming. Yeah, you're, uh, you're dangling his lead in front of him, Zach. It's huh? kind of a big clue. Oh, well, that's me, told. <laughs> Where you off? Uh, reckon I need some fresh air after all. Yeah, well, give us a minute. I'm... Sorry for the early hour. What can we do for you? Actually, it's Mr White here we'd like to speak with, if that's OK. So, how can I help? We're trying to trace Mr. Tozer's last known movements and whereabouts, joining the dots, as it were. Well, I'm not sure I can help you very much. You were seen up there recently, um, close to where the rock was found? Yeah, I already told you. It was, uh, I was out for a run. On private property, that's right. However, you can possibly understand that things have changed now we have a DNA match for Mr. Tozer's blood. We just want to go over everything again. Yeah, of course. You regularly run up there? Sometimes. But it wasn't the first time you'd been there... for a run. No. Oh, but then I, I did used to live there. You used to, but not for some time. And the writing in the shack, you know, the one that mysteriously burnt down? Yeah, I, I already told you. I wrote that when I was still living there. Lachlan is a... Uh... What was it you said again? King. Lachlan is a king, he was supposed to say. That's right. Shame you never actually finished it. Look, we've already been over this. And I've told you everything I know, which is, is pretty much nothing. Well, well, just one more question then. Uh, how would you describe your relationship with Mr Tozer? I barely knew him. Everybody thought he was Jerry's uncle for a starter. Other than that? He was a con man. I'm guessing people like him make a lot of enemies in the end, but I was not one of them. OK. Well, thanks for your time, as ever. If anything else pops into mind, give me a call. So, um... Do you really think somebody killed him? I'd say it's a serious possibility, wouldn't you? <laughs> 